I think the message sunk in. She obviously hasn't given up hope. Huh. Well, not my fault. What Gabby and I had, that's my past. Hate is my future. I'd have to be a fool to let her go. You mean that? I do. Look, man, I may not have gotten an Ivy League education. May not have been introduced to the finer things in life. But I do realize that Kate is across the board exceptional. Yeah, you're right. She is exceptional. I don't want to see her get hurt. I would never hurt her. I hope not. Because if you do, you're going to be answering to me. Okay, how does Gabby fit into all of this? It seems Abigail recruited her to help her drug and kidnap Gwen. Well, she has the necessary skill set, but uh, I thought they hated each other. Not as much as they both hate Gwen. So they teamed up. But then Gabby realized that Abigail was going too far, and ultimately it was Gabby who let Gwen go. So to be fair, I haven't asked Abigail her side of the story yet. And I'm... I, I can't believe that she'd actually ever do something like that. Oh, really? After everything Gwen has put her through, I think it makes perfect sense that she would be upset. You know, I really, I can't believe that you're just gonna give up. Like, this was always more of a fight for you than it was for me. Oh, really? Yeah, because I think Gwen totally screwed you over. Oh, yeah, she did. So did you and Chad and uh, half the population of Salem. Well, some might see it a little differently. Point is, I'm not going to waste my time and somebody so useless as Gwen. So what are you going to do? Are you going to spend your time dreaming up ways to get Jake back in this bed? No. No, I'm going to run a business. You know, it can still be the same terms as before. You help me get Gwen and I will help you break up Jake and Kate. I know you still want him, okay? And I promise you, I promise... I will do whatever I can to help make that happen. So, do we have a deal? Um, are you telling me that you want someone else to be Jules' godmother? It's just, see, oh, uh, yeah. You mean your mama? Oh, yeah, well, of course, of course, Tammy would be your first choice. Oh, it's such a pity. She has such a busy touring schedule. But Lonnie, Carlin, you don't have to feel guilty about not choosing her, okay? I'm sure she'll be fine with it. I mean, come on, Tammy, you know, she knows she's still going to be a big and important part of the twins' lives. And, you know, I love, I love Tammy.